Now, modern agriculture is heavily relying on technology to maximize production and increase profits. This includes the use of digital technologies to collect, analyze, and visualize data to inform policies aimed at improving production. Shoshin Innovations Hub is one such venture developing technology targeting fish farmers and climate change. Edward Chair tells us how Shoshin uses live labs to provide real-time data to help farmers make informed decisions. At her farm in Kisi, Mary Onsongo has been railing fish the last few years after the county government encouraged local farmers to embrace aquaculture. However, she suffered major losses with her first batch of fingerlings. <laughs> To address this, Shoshin, a venture founded and run by young Kenyan techies, developed water testing technology, Isamaki, to help the farmers understand how to properly rear fish. We do agri-tech, which is focused on the farmers, uh, climate tech, it's focused on ensuring that organizations are compliant, especially with ESG reporting, and also uh, aquatech. Aquatech is focused on the marine life uh, fish in the fish pond and in, even in the rivers and also smart cities one of the things that again organizations or is part of the sdgs by 2030 so bringing in technologies that actually tackle the smart city perspective so how does isamaki work this is essentially a technology that helps you monitor your pond conditions and your feeding regime. Our technology is app and USSD based. You see that caters for both farmers who have smartphone and, and feature phones. There is a gadget we give the farmer to keep uh, testing the different parameters needed, temperature, alkalinity, pH, all those parameters that are needed. This farmer takes the water sensor, dips it in water, it will read every other parameter, salinity, the alkalinity, the pH, and all that, and send it to the farmer. Either through the app, it will be a notification on the app. For the USSD uh, farmers, it will be an SMS that comes to you. So both are well taken care of. We've also incorporated AI in our technology to ensure that this massive data we are collecting on behalf of the farmer, we analyze it. It makes sense for the farmer and we do recommendations on exactly what they need to do with their ponds. Farmers like Mary who have since embraced this technology say their fish no longer die in the ponds and the yields have increased. Willie says they look forward to innovating more to be the go-to hub for everyday challenges. Edward Chwea, Made in Kenya, Citizen TV.